Hey guys, Mike Seiko coming to you from my old residence. It didn't look like this when we lived here. My mom and dad had this house built in 1973. We moved in. I had some of the best times of my life here. I can remember we had some big pine trees in the front yard. And at that time, we had a football party here and the head coach at the time was in there having a good time. Well, my brother and I and a couple big dudes picked up his car and put it in between two pine trees. Well, he came out a little bit liquored up and needless to say, he wasn't very happy with us and neither was my dad. <laughs> but I'll never forget that moment. Also, I can remember the front yard here, the tires were coming in and they were burning the grass all the time. Well, my dad had me put about 500 nails into a green board that we painted. We threw pine needles on it. And uh, later on that night, somebody came through and tried to burn the grass. Well, guess what? Four flat tires. So my father was thinking ahead. You know, another amazing thing is, I never knew at this time when I lived here what this address number is and what it signifies in my life. And I'll tell you, I see this on the clock constantly. Seems like every day or two or three, the same three numbers come up. What do you think those three numbers are? It's not on this mailbox. 911. You talk about irony in your life. When I lived at 911, many years ago, before 911 was even around, and I became a 911 responder. And I'm now at 25 years coming up here in February. Amazing. What's your destiny, guys? What's your irony? Where are you gonna be? Look across the street. There was nothing here. As a matter of fact, this house to the left was here. This house was not, these houses were not. We used to hit the flats out there and go in to get scallops. All kinds of cool stuff. Right out there, Gulf of Mexico sitting right there. Amazing. Wow. Just remember, you're gonna have something that's gonna send you down a path. Don't know what it is, but when you see it, jump on it. I'll talk to you guys in the next one.